What's up, everybody? This is the Poker Coaching Study Session. Uh, today, we're going to be looking at a uh, good old spot for the big blind button versus big blind. So uh, let's get started. Uh, this is going to be the button strategy. I will go over these uh, real quickly just so we remind what's the overall strategy. So big blind checks a lot. Uh, once it's checked to him, uh, the button is going to bet a lot. And as we see here, it seems to be really high card dependent, but we'll take a deeper dive into this. Uh, facing the small bet, this is going to be the big blind strategy. So notice here how like on pair boards, we mostly defend by raising and everything here is fine and nice. Uh, and then this is our response against the big bet. Facing the big bet, we never really raise big. And uh, yeah. But interesting that raises, it's interesting that it raises on high pair boards a decent amount. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it doesn't mind very much. Um, but now uh, let's take a look at the overall strategy, just based purely on high cards, because you like uh, whenever we try to make strategies. Uh, you know, it's all a question of grouping. And this is a new grouping that uh, Joss made. And I think it's really interesting. So uh, as we see here, uh, this is the button strategy. So the button on the nay side board is range betting, uh, like 90% of the time. Uh, whenever there's a king, it slices down a little bit. So now we're at 80%. Whenever there's a queen, it gets worse for the button. So queen eye boards are not so good for the button somehow. Well, it's still really good. It's just not as good as ace and king. I don't know. It seems to be really close to, uh, yeah, no, no. I guess that's right. I'm but 70%. it's still like uh, a jack is a lot better and a 10 is still better, right? Yeah, uh, this high board. Uh, so... Big blind doesn't have that many uh, jack, uh, jack off and ten off and uh, yes, queen off. So somehow the queen is not that good for the button. So a queen high board is not that good. You know, we're mostly betting it, but I guess like I mean, maybe the queen just likes to check a lot if there's an ace or a king on the flop, and that's gonna be no, 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 no. Oh, These are one hundred fifty-four queen high boards. Oh, queen high, right, right, right. But when I look at this, I see a reflection of the, the big blind range. Uh, he has a lot of uh, queen highs and also king highs, big blind. Yeah, but on king high, we still bet a lot. Yeah, true, true. But uh, less than on ace high, for instance. Uh, the, the button also has a lot. So whenever it gets that around the nate high board, or roughly just betting 60%. And look at the sizes. Whenever the high card gets lower, uh, the more we, like whenever the, the high cards get slower, we get to use bigger sizes here. Yeah, but it's also because it's a more draw heavy. Yeah? Yeah. So that's, yeah. Difficult to say what it is. Uh... Yeah, I mean, the lower the card gets, typically it's gonna be more grouped combos Right. Yeah. Yeah. So it's hard to say if it's only the low card, but also the the uh, the drawiness of the board. Yeah. Uh, what's the range of the big blind? Does he call every queen X? No. Uh, down the ones he doesn't queen. raise, he's going to raise some of the better ones. Yeah, but he's going yeah. down to queen five off or something like that. Queen six off. Yeah. Uh, well, and the button opens only queen. Seven uh, off? Seven. Queen eight, maybe. Queen eight, queen seven. Maybe. We're not depending queen three? I don't think button opens queen seven off. Yeah, but then queen Where's, eight. Do you have to range this, uh, Louis? I think it's actually, I don't even think they, yeah, I'm not even sure they open queen eight off. Maybe? Yeah, you know? eight off. Okay. Yeah, and, the, and, the, and the big blind is defending all his queens. No. So big blind has way more queens than uh, yeah, yeah, and, he's, and he doesn't doesn't defend all jacks, so that's why jacks is a little bit lower than queens. Yeah, that's, that's I say it's a reflection of the the mm -hmm. 
opening ranges. Uh, Any else on your notes? So the big lines range has more queens as he defends them all. We just lack ace queen and uh, some king yeah. queen. Sure. And but and also, sets. Also, but they, yeah. mm. and we have no set. We have no sets on any flops, right? True. No sets. Queen high boards. But your top pair advances uh, is on the queen. Not that good. <laughs> or the button. <laughs> it's it's big blind. Good, is it, but not super good. Big blind versus button. Is the big one raising all his pairs? Yeah. Yeah. For sure. No pairs. So um, raising or jamming? Jamming yeah. quite a few. The low ones. Yeah. yeah. Jamming the low ones. Just the low ones. Yeah, some of the high things also or not. Can we do, can we do the, the preflop ninja of these positions? Yes. You should know those. Sure, uh, we're gonna, we're gonna look at it. Yeah. I just want to look at these real quick. So it's interesting how like on like we don't have a big sample here. So it's just one and one, but on three high boards or two high boards, like we can range that. It's not as bad. But what is really bad is like eight high board to four high boards. Uh, we check them a lot. Yeah, the big blind hasn't. And then, uh, and then we use big size when, when the button. So button. we jam pocket eights full frequency, but not pocket sevens full frequency. So maybe that's why it checks a bit more on the sevens. That's nothing to do with it. In my opinion, because that's so... So such a small percentage of uh, the total hands that uh, Big Blind has that doesn't matter that much. All right. Well, I mean, we won't. We shouldn't have sets eight, but we could have sets of sevens. Is all I'm saying. True, but uh, you, you also have a lot of offsuit sevens, and sure. uh, Button doesn't have offsuit sevens almost. Sure. So th there, your range advantage is way bigger than in the. That's a, a bigger percentage of your range than the trips. All right, so these are our also, pair yeah. boards. 7x. Uh, so this is going to be the button strategy on pair boards. And we have 177 of them here. Uh, and like it's based on the iCarter. Um, <clears throat> this one basically use uh, small bets. So this is going to be like ace, uh, queen, queen. Uh, oh. no. Yeah. Is that yep. ace, ace, x? No, nope. it's ace, uh, queen, queen, uh, ace, deuce, deuce, stuff like that. So it can also be ace, a, ace, x. Huh? Well, that's also one of the paired high card ace. Yeah, but we have this one here. This one is the ace, ace, x. Yeah. Or king, king, x. Queen, queen, x. I think this is more useful. Yeah, I know. Um, so this one we can, yeah, clearly see, uh, seven, sixes, fives, fours, threes, even. <laughs> so again, the queen high boards, a pair of queen high board is not as good as, uh, the other ones. You prefer uh, the jack. The pair of queens, you mean? Yeah. 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 Same stuff. So whenever it gets around the seven, we check a lot. Okay. So that's something I've been doing wrong because I've been range betting whenever I was at pair board from the bottom versus big blind. Yeah, I, I guess I should one. slow yeah. down a lot if it's a low card. Well, you should also check your database if uh, people are overfolding. <clears throat> because I don't think they defend enough. Yeah, yeah but if you... Uh, yeah, okay, but uh, at least you're exploitable if you do that. Uh, let's put it that way. Yeah. Yeah. Just be careful of doing that. If somebody else seals it, it's going to exploit you, Louis. 
If I see your sea bed in yeah. heaven, <laughs> I'm going to raise you. I'm going to raise this maniac guy on GG every time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Until he learns, huh? So. <laughs> Do you also have this stuff for uh, Rainbow and New Town? Yep, yeah, yeah. Yeah, rack, boards. Yeah, actually not, uh, I, I don't make a uh, difference between uh, two-tone boards and uh, rainbow boards because the difference is mostly uh, very uh, slim between those. So I really like this because we can see that uh, like even the queen high board, it's like 70, almost 70%. So it's all, it's really close to a range bet. For me, a range bet is 80%. Um, so whatever is really close to it, is close to a range bet. But like we can see that if it's a pair board and it's seven or less, uh, we don't get to do as much betting, as much range betting. Yeah, maybe if uh, it's a... Uh... Together with a high card, you can uh, bet it, but otherwise, uh, yeah, you should be very careful. Monotone boards, the 9i1 is the best. <laughs> then you have the mo most uh, overcards uh, for the flush. <laughs> so tell us a bit more about this one, Jobs. Rack. This is uh, without uh, any uh, straight uh, possibilities, without any uh, straight draw possibilities. And not monotone, not paired. Okay, so this is basically a dry board, right? Very dry. So like ten five, like ten five two. Yes, that's still just in it. Yeah. Yeah, ten five three is not in it. So why is nine five two not in it? Uh, ooh. <laughs> Top of my head, I have to look at uh, the code. <laughs> we might need to rework this one. <laughs> no, it's it's just. Uh, I, I think also like we could call it dry instead of rag here. Yeah, it's dry. Yeah, yeah it's, uh, two tone boards are in there. Eh? Maybe not open enders possible, like ten six twos. Uh, well, there. Yeah, five. if you have two open enders possible, then also it's not in there. So nine five is two open enders uh, possible at least straight draw and uh, no one gut shot and one open ender. Yeah. Oh, so this one is really interesting. So this is gonna be the straight board. So whenever it's an A side board with a straight on it, or possibly where the button could have flopped the straight. He's like sizing up 50% of the time or more. Yeah, you can triple barrel it off, I think. Yeah, that's what I'm wondering indeed, uh, if you can do that uh, almost uh, any time. <laughs> well, the devil, the depends devil on turn be, and river, of course. The devil will be in the details when we start running the hands. Yeah, of course. It's, it's, uh, it also depends if it's uh, two-tone or not. And, uh, if it's uh, ace jack 10 or ace uh, queen 10, uh, it makes a difference. Or if ace king 10 makes a difference. But you have a lot of two pair also. Eh? You have two pair advances, you have a set advantage, you have uh, straight advantage on those boards. So that's a lot of advantage probably. But if you bet and the uh, big bind calls, and then he uh, folds his junk, so your advantage slings. Right. Well, especially if you bet big. Yeah, especially if you bet big. Indeed, yeah. yeah, it's also a function of uh, how wide can you continue uh, with, uh, if you bet big. You can continue pretty wide still uh, because you have a lot of uh, yeah, good shots and that kind of stuff. If you even continues with good shots, I don't know. I mean, they're just, big blind still going to have to pair, defend like any pair against the big bet probably, so. Uh, maybe not the bottom pair. I don't know. Probably be a lot of barreling on that, those. I, th I think he overfolds a lot, eh? Yeah, I mean, he's going to overfold a lot, but I don't think he's going to get to, we'll see. I don't think he's going to get to fold pairs, so there might be a lot of barreling on yeah. those with the textures. Yeah, but bottom pair, I wonder if he can uh, already start folding some of them. Yeah, I don't know. We'll see. 
So that straightforward is going to be like ace jack 10 and you think he's going to be defending a lot of 10s yeah that's what i'm saying maybe you can uh, uh, i mean like 10 9 queen 10 king 10 queen like if he has check, three check draws this, for sure the six high board pot betting is pretty cool why is that that you bet bet big well it's the biggest pot bet yeah six high straight board uh, the, the big blind has a lot of draws. Yeah, but five high and seven high is not that much of a difference. Is it? Yeah, that's a minor difference. 65 or 100, that's not that big a difference. <clears throat> At least in my opinion, I mean. Nine high and lower. I uh, see on the wet boards also that you uh, uh, bet, uh, still bet a decent amount big if the uh, low cards are uh, draw heavy. Yeah, you want to disincentivize a lot of the touch draws and combos to continue, right? Yep, that's what you do. Yeah, you charge them to uh, continue indeed. That is. Uh... We size up the mount on six high boards. Yeah. That's probably that, uh, yeah. He doesn't have a lot of two pair there. So you have a nut advantage, even a more nut advantage probably. Apart from the straights, yeah, that the big blind can have. <laughs> and again, he has no sets, which is nice. I mean, he shouldn't, of course, in our yeah, games. He... For instance, a 6 3 do deuce board. Yeah, you can bet big. I mean, he can have 5 4, and he can have straight, but. The reality is 95% of the people, I think, in the stakes we're playing aren't jamming twos, threes, fours to, at 40 bigs. They're just going to call. So it gets a little. Yeah, I don't think the, the sets are. Uh, but are not a lot of combos, huh? No, it's something worth keeping in the back of your head, though, I think. Yeah, yeah, true. So how do you define a wet texture, Josh? Uh, two cards where you can have an uh, open-ended straight draw. That's wet. And if there are uh, uh, twice two cards that can have uh, good shots, for instance, uh, 8-7, then you can have an open-ended straight. 8-5, uh, then you can have an open-ended straight with 7-6. 8-9, okay, uh, okay. uh, no, what's say 9-5, uh, deuce. 9-6, deuce. Yeah, I will look it up in my code. I always forget. I have to write it down. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so I, I have to write it down and then we can say you don't like it or we like it. Otherwise, uh, I'm talking yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. somewhere in the code. <laughs> so, a side board that are wet are range bet. So, it's really close to the overview strategy where the queen is not, it's really not good versus the jack and 10 is better. So, that's something that I Bets are bigger, aren't the bets bigger? Yeah, course, yeah well, it's a bit bigger than uh, in the overview, too. So, less, like the good cards are bigger. like ace, in between, king, jack, ten, and nine. And probably depends on how drawish the board is. I mean, if it's uh, eight, seven, it's more drawish than eight, six, for instance, because there's a one gap, or eight, five, and two gap. All right, and now so, oh, we still have this one, right? Wet draw card. Yeah, that's the, for instance, uh, ace eight seven is he, uh, listed here as eight, uh, with the eight as a draw card. Okay. But, um, 
we just made those to uh, see if there's a difference. Okay, any patterns we can see here? Looks like it's always sizing up towards the eight. Yeah, nine down, it's sizing up. Huh? No, not in the low balls, actually. On three dues, and that kind of says not sizing up. Four dues, four three. So, so that, that's like, okay. That's like eight, seven dues, for example. Could be, but could also be uh, ace, eight, seven. Or in this one with the eight. It's the draw card, the, the card oh. where the draw revolves around. That's just listed here. Okay. And now let's look real quick into the big blind strategy because the big blind has a small dunking strategy as we see here. So this, the small blind dunk is always around the six high boards. That's the highest frequency it gets. It gets around 23%. Uh, the second best is seven high or five high boards. And that's that's like really it because even on four high boards, we don't the big blind doesn't get to do it. So it, it's really a seven high board, six high board, or five high board, and that's about it. So it's no problem if you never do it? Uh, probably not. But yeah, you uh, check race uh, some. <clears throat> you can check race more than if you don't do it. If you want to simplify, you can easily check range here. But for those that want to implement the donking strategy, it's going to be around six high boards where you do it the most. Then you have to look at the And then I'm surprised to see that you don't get to do it on like four or three dudes. Yeah, for me, it's not a surprise, actually. Yeah, because we don't have a lot. We don't have any two-pair combos. We have no yeah. sets. We have no two-pair combos. We don't so. have five, three. Yeah. You, you, you so don't have two pairs there. The, the two pairs yeah. are not the... the... Yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, no, uh, no two-pair no two combos. I mean, we have the suited ones, but it's not enough. At least that's what I see. Eh? If you have a uh, 20% nut advantage, then you can uh, lead. Otherwise, you can't. Something like that. 20% eh? is just... Uh... I still like to have some donks. Like, I still like to know what the donks are. I like to have some, even though it's not a high percentage, because some players know that they're supposed to check back on a lot of textures, and then... Against you're good not, players, it's and the uh, high card comes and you're screwed. Against good players, it's nice to have a neat uh, long bet. Huh? Yeah, against people that I can count on C betting a ton, it's nice to check raise because you get extra chips in. Yep. <clears throat> <clears throat> it's actually the bet boards are only uh, uh, one gappers. And if the, the highest and lowest, yeah, I'm going to say, or two open enders. So it's really the six. So the key card for the big blind is the six, the five, and the seven. Yeah, depending on. Uh, you also <laughs> see that in his range uh, that he has an. Uh, the yeah, what was open in a decent amount of the offsuit eights? Yeah, not the sevens and the sixes and the fives and the button uh, and the big blind has those a lot. They say queen eight, king eight, jack eight. What about the eight, okay. nine, eight? So the straight boards, six are again, again are the best, seven high, five high. So the key, the key cards are. Okay. So, so I think all this is going to be very. I think all this is going to be very similar versus cutoff as well. I think the range is really close. Yeah, yeah. But moves one card up, eh? A bit. Yeah. So let's see. Let's see. Let's see. If you yeah. would be nice to uh, uh, one time do that from. Uh, under gun first big blind and then uh, low jack first big blind high jack first big blind etc etc yeah 
than you see that pattern in it. I mean, our key is really the uh, bottom, like as always, it's the worst offsuit combos in the uh, in position oh, player's right. range, you know? So like low jack isn't going to be opening the, those uh, eights. He's opening tens, huh? so then the nines and the eights are also uh, for the big blind. Yeah, uh, I think Ijack, Ijack might have some nines, like king nine. I'm not sure off top. Yeah, of that. then it's then it's around the eight, for instance. And but the nines are still getting there, then. Huh? Let's see. Yeah, he doesn't really have nines. King nine a little bit, ten nine a little bit, not much. So yeah. Already has nice. All right. Oh, hold. Are you sure? Hold. I raised fifty percent. Uh, we mix queen seven. We start mixing the queen seven off. We just looked at it. No, that's for the cutoff. Uh, I think or not. Queen five. Oh easy. yeah, queen five. Ah, yeah. Yes, get queen it. Five yeah. That's a raise, right? Raise. I hope so. Oh no. <laughs> Uh, Six dudes. Bold. Oh, really? Six green dudes. six. Bold. Our prince green this. Just go to poker coaching. Can I open green. that? Yep. Raise it up. Oh, no. Do, green to fold. Do we have yeah. limp? We don't have limps, right? On 40 big ones. No, 40 bigs, we don't limp. Uh, Limping, uh, right. well, I maybe don't. not King Deuce, but King Deuce, sport. Sport or well, I think I opened like King Five, yeah, King Five, King something. Six, something like that. Race, race, race. Yeah. race, 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 race. Fold. 100% raise, huh? Uh, raise. raise. Yeah, I think King 5 is the bottom. It's a raise, yeah. 50%. King 5? Uh, all there, yeah, the offshore chain. You open every uh, 5. Uh, four, five. I think. We it's open Queen 7. Yeah, it's early open Queen 7. I don't think we open this. But, I think I it's 50-50. This one is bold. It's okay, yeah. Open. It's okay. Open. Oh, Absolutely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jack Seven's a bit more connected than the Queen Cold. Seven, so I guess that's why. <laughs> yeah, I, I oh, think. It's oh shit! Is, uh, four lean. Four lean. I think we got uh, it. I just is call. Suited. You Suda just call here, kid. Yeah, I'm just calling. All in can never yeah. be a mistake. Yeah. Oh, yeah. An off suit is a call. I think. No, they both also a chance. Okay. You're on the button, so you have a lot of. Yeah. Who's calling that King Three suited? <laughs> King four. Why, King why are we pulling Queen Seven? Because you don't want the Seven. Seven is bad. Yeah, yeah. You're bluffing the bluffs, blocking the bluffs with the Seven. That, that is the blocking part of uh, the. What Seven does he bluff with? A Seven. Yeah. You're blocking A Seven. Hmm? That part is difficult. You block his fault. No, it's uh, he bluffs. I don't know. Jamming H5 off. Hmm. Yeah, that's fancy. I don't find this one. I find all of these. I never find the A6. Just calling with kings and aces. Uh huh. Is that in position? Out position? Huh? In Whenever position. I call with queens, there they just always flap an ace. Yeah, you just all flop. Uh, th then just go all in, as the chart says, so that he's most of the time. Fold. 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 Race. All in. All in. 18%. Fold. 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 That's a bit nitty. Oh, no, it's not nitty. <laughs> it's a fold. You're a bit spewy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Raise. Uh-oh. 
Fold. 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 Yeah. Oh, yeah? You, you guys think it's a fold? Yeah, you don't have more than 50% against any two almost. So. I'm afraid this is a call. I'm afraid oh, it's well. a fold. It's a 40 big blinds call in. You might have to. Ah, oh, we need fives. At we least then maybe for H4 or something like that. I thought we would play all pairs. If, but I guess we're too deep, too deep. I'm never calling with fives for a week. Okay. You're, you're never calling with fives. Yeah. Why not? Well, people on GG don't jam because that range with 40 big blinds. What are they jamming? Are they jamming H4 suited, that kind of stuff? Well, and they, they do all kind of all kind of stuff. Against a normal tree bet you can call, but for not against a jam. So raise this one. Mm. Get stuffed on them. Yeah, knowing what we have. Yeah. These guys are super annoying. He's given the blinds too many combos to jam. Not, he's just uh, jamming all, always or tree betting always. Hey, jam, I six suited. I got the small bond, I don't know. We asked for this function, eh, that he... Uh, All right, we yeah. rolled for 99. <laughs> three bets all in. <laughs> three bets are, goes all in. I mean, that's what he asked for. 99 is a clear all in. Do we raise what this do we one? Do what? What are we doing uh, we against that? We can open this. Fold. Fold. Easy fold. Yeah, there's a fold. Oh, it's a fold. Oh, five is a you guys don't want to steal the blinds. Just a little raise. I open this mm -hmm. one. No, it's 100% fold. I, I would open. I would These, uh, these guys are three betting maniacs. I know. <laughs> it doesn't matter. I want to open. This is 100% three betting. Oh. Uh -oh. Yeah. This looks like an extremely yeah. troublesome hand. <laughs> uh -oh. Oh, no, all in all in whenever oh. I get these kind of hands not, you know I, I know that I'm in trouble now I'm just in trouble yeah, me also. I, you have to jam but uh... <sighs> me buy equity hey. next tournament oh you don't have to <laughs> you don't have to jam <laughs> that's why I play 67 of them in a day <laughs> hmm. Old. Old. Raise it up. Oh no. Oh. Lay it off. Fold. 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 Oh wait, shoot it. Never mind. Oh, raise. That's raise. a raise. Easy raise. Yeah. Fold. I'm uh, wondering about our bluffing. Yeah. I, I want to have a queen or a king. Uh, I fold this. I might call it Jack Seven mm -hmm. now. Jack Eight for sure. I'm calling with Jack Eight for sure. Jack Eight. Oh, check green six. Hey, can green we check six. that range again, Louis? The difference between four betting against small blind and big blind is, is low suited aces are different. Ace deuce. And because you don't want to block his six five bluffs or something like that. Uh, what do you mean by what is uh, the ace five? Well, uh, against the small blind, we're four betting a six, a five, a four. Small blinds no, have more bluffs, small. I think. Yeah, his yeah, bluffs are around to six or seven. Small blind is uh, three betting more linear than the big blind normally. What is this range? So, what's the range of the big blind? Three betting. So, this is against the small blind? And this one is against the, the big blind. Yeah. And what's, I mean, the way, what's the big blind? What's the big blind? way, we're bluffing? using the ace and king blockers, right? That's the important thing, I think. So, I like king five, king six, king seven. I find I these all the use, time. Oh, I, I never find it all in here. I think if you just uh -huh. use the low suited wheels, I don't really think the exact combination matters that much when we when we're supposed to three bet them, as long as you're using some of them. Yeah, as long as you're a bit balanced there, then it's okay, I think. I guess I need to find more all ins with my king sevens. Nah, you can pass. <laughs> what do you mean? I just uh, go with queen eight. I need no to one. find more king sevens. Okay. <laughs> I will find more king sevens. I will butt you next time. Race call. 
Paul, I uh, call you. Don't be uh, in it. <laughs> yes, be in it in this spot. Is it the same? Paul. Uh, is it the same as against the big blind? Five plus? I can't remember. Yeah. Uh, I wish we had King Seven. Oh, a hundred percent. That's right. the first day, isn't it? Yeah, sure. I didn't, get a, I didn't get a hundred percent. I never get a hundred percent if I, I sometimes when I choose to practice one hand. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if I practice ten hands, maybe I get there. <laughs> Have mostly of the time at ten percent uh, mistakes, something like that. Mm, okay, but the trainer, fifty or twenty. Forty big <laughs> Now it gets serious. Oh yeah. Ah, uh, now we do the easy stuff. So today we're going to be in position. And you're going to force it to check. A big blind. Oh, we're in position. You're forcing big blind to check. Yeah. You want to make yeah, a new recording, Louis? Not forcing him to check. I could we be checked uh, instances. Yeah, there's an ace. I'm betting. Yeah. Big. I'm bet uh, no, not big. Small. Yeah. Oh no, I don't know what to do anymore. I don't know anything about turns. <laughs> Anyone know how to play turns? Yeah, yeah just check. I checked this one. We check? Okay. Kevin is not good for our range, so I check. Uh, hey, you call I'm calling. Yeah. Yeah, a lot of draws missed. A lot of draws missed. I have no hearts, no spades. Uh, okay, so on the no, club, it went bad and he calls. So he has a little something here. On the turn, like he has some sevens, right? And on the river, like he has sevens in his range. So he yeah, could have a bluff. seven. Ooh, it's he a could have a, a, a nine. The only thing we beat is a nine. You can have King Queen create it's a, uh, that's no, the, nine, the nine. The nine's a chop. We beat all his bluffs. I think he should have a lot of bluffs here. I'm pulling. No, that's right. I don't think his bluffs are se his bluffs are seven, eight, and six, seven. I think it's oh, a well, it's not bluff anymore. You're so. you're never getting you're never getting anything to fold with a forty eight chip bets. Exactly. You but you're not already beating. He has it then. Yeah, fold. Could have ten. I would fold here. I'm not. I'm not calling. I guess this is a call. He has an ace for sure. For sure. <laughs> He's got a seven. He has this guy has no bluff with this size here. Yeah. <laughs> of course he has. That's I'm a pretty sure he bluffs. does not. The films <laughs> and practice don't. But <laughs> he doesn't have any bluffs. We don't have any calls. Yeah, yeah that's they, they want us to call. That's a very thin value bet. All right, range explorer. The bet small, the equity. So he's bluffing with king eyes and queen eyes. Okay, so there's some bluffs. Flash Are my opponents ever bluffing king eye here? Calling me on the flop with king eye and then bluffing on the river. No. I don't know about that. <laughs> For a tiny bet. I'm a bit tiny, yeah, so they can, uh, the suit can yeah. take. Oh, well, I think most players they probably kind of value. He might be value betting those king highs. Yeah, king, the oh, hearts are flush, flush draws. draws. Yeah, it's busted flush draws. It's all he's, busted he, flush draws. He's jamming for thirty and a half percent. That's the reason you can call because you don't want him. <laughs> what is he jamming? Ah, okay, yeah, all right, all right. That makes sense. That makes sense. We don't block heart, so we can call. Are we calling with king nine off suit with a heart in our hand? No. Uh, at least I wouldn't. Yeah. Yeah. But what is he jamming? He's, ja he's jamming 13%. Let's see what he calls with when we click it back. Check this. That's 580. Five, <laughs> that's that's got to be his jack eye flush draws that missed. Sevens. Wow. That's his, uh, his going all in with. Is busted not flush rods and jack eye flush. King seven of uh, seven is of course uh, trips, huh? So yeah, trips. Also, there's also trips in there. Yeah. And even a jack eight straight. So let's, uh, let's raise a small bet and see what I want to see what he calls with. 
You want to bet small and see what he calls with? Uh, raise him like yeah, he bets small, right? So just raise him. Well, you bet small, and you want to raise. What yeah, yeah, just one seventy six. I want to see what he does with that. Tens are starting to fold, huh? Yeah, so I'm the lowest ones. Also, depending, maybe if you have a heart in it or not. I mean, I feel like tens is a, it's a hand that would bet that size for value. Yeah, but he also check raises this so song with ace. I don't know about the tens. But that's hard to say. Uh, it depends on uh, I think the ten is you have in front of you. It's just uh, like uh, he's never betting a ten. I can't well, never is. Bet a, lot, a lot of players are not betting tens. Bet them all. Yeah, uh, oh, a lot. A lot of players are not betting tens. Solver is yes, of course. Yeah. But I mean, it's an ideal size for tens. Like you block bet kind of right. So I mean, tens is your second pair on the board. That's kind of like the motion. Yeah, but uh, yeah, I don't block bet a lot, so uh, I know the solver does, but uh, I don't. One of my leaks. Do we bet large once with this hand and then give up? No. I don't think we want to Actually, check. It's a straight board, jack high. I mean, I think we check, I think we're giving up. No, yeah, even ace comps, you don't give up, but that's, that's something else. Yeah, that's so wet and draw heavy. That, uh, that's ugly. Yeah, we have no interaction board, with uh, it. I, I would uh, check. Uh... Yeah, I'm checking here. Yeah, I mean, we're not going to pick up any. Act. We can't keep barreling with this hand with, yeah, like, just, with nothing. Yeah, there's there's no good turn cards for us that aren't an ace. We still need to find like a lot of that. Okay, so with ace, I maybe not. Let's see. Ace of spade, well, I'm sure. Bet a lot on this board. I mean, yeah, like 50%. you think about no, it's a bet. A bunch of our junky hands have a have a king in them, they have a queen in them, they have a seven in them, they have more interaction, you know. Yeah, but we range bet this board almost. So yeah, that's uh, 80%. Yeah. Something like that. Yeah. Well, it's a bet board. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> I wouldn't that find somehow it. what I've been struggling with. I recently, uh, I, I, I find too many checks from the button. That's so. Do we size video. up now? Do we get we make it a two street bluff or are we done? No, the, this is, is uh, not good for us. Not good he, for our. He's going to start falling eights now when we barrel again. Maybe some bad tens. I think we got to barrel one more and then give up. Or we can bet my done. We have to barrel. I don't know. Five or something I like that. Check. Ace high can win. The bet small spot or check. No, no, no. Hold. Just fold down, yeah. Mm -hmm. What? It's 10 3. Oh, he's got space, so he's never folding turn. Oh, we have ace king, of course. He doesn't. Yeah, we have the nuts sometimes here. Yeah. That's why. Yeah. But uh, let's see what Tenzi yeah. does for when we barrel turn. I guess not, he's got to have a redraw to continue, I imagine. No. I mean, this well, is exactly we didn't let flop. We didn't let flop. Ace, uh, no. ace 10, king 10, queen 10, 10, 9, 10, 8, they're all calling. 10, 7 might start. 10, 7 can call. 10, 6 probably starts folding. Against a small bet? Oh, uh, well, yeah. Yeah, but nah. you did that small, huh? so there's a lot of calling. Well, I would have bet sixty percent anyway. That's what I thought we were gonna do. But still calling them all. Yeah, the solver is, but uh... <laughs> I thought he would start folding like the ten six and worse. It's folding some eights. There's a king here. I'm betting. We have a dude. I'm checking. Okay. Check. Cool. I'm checking now. Yeah. Then we can check. Yeah, we check any parents from us. So. Yeah. Two down. Cool. We stuck down on this nine. We got a bed in. 
and we get, got some value from it. Are the kind of hands that tilt the racks too. It's fine. Ooh, top pair and a flush. Oh, queen high. So we bet a lot on monotone birds. Ah. Just keep betting. The ace is good for us. That's small yeah. again, right? I think we I think we bet small often when the ace comes off. Yeah. This is but a key card for the button where we don't right? polarize. Yeah, it's, it's yeah, it's still a don't flush board. Really polarize here because we're we betting a range advantage. So with that small, I, yeah. I see that a lot. Yeah. No, I thought no. we would size up because oh, it's no, a key uh, card. A key card comes for the 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 button and then <clears> size up. I can call. Yeah, just check feedback. back. No, no check in often. Yep. I was expecting he has a lot of one spade hands. He had a gutter and a flush redraw. It's a nice, uh, and a pretty good flush redraw with the jack. So just bet here, yeah. I would bet. Got him, he's calling. Oh, low straight. I want to check back. We can check this. Straight. Yeah, I think checking is okay. Now, uh, um, shit. We got a call, right? <laughs> this is where I don't know what to do. I know, well, like, on the first three, but after uh, I check the flop, it's so tough. Oh, okay. uh, also the I would call. Yeah, I just fold. Oh, it's a mandatory call. Mandatory call. I can't, it's not folding. Oh, it's folding oh, a lot. Mixing. What's the hell is going also? The 10 is bad. It's yeah, I mean, like, even if, the 10, even if the 10 hits, it's not so great if he blasts it, right? Like, if he blasts on the 10, indeed, it's not great, but uh, you have to repair. So the 10 is blocking the bluffs. Can you show our flop reins? Because that's important, right? For the blocking the bluffs and doesn't have any draws for a straight. I'm realizing. So thing. we're betting ace king and checking ace ten. He only has to have a seven eh, to have a draw two straight. So he can still have a lot of draws two straight. I think. So we are checking. Kind of texture. We are checking half of the time, and when we bet, it's like top pairs, danglers to the straight. Then the upper dangler to the, the straight, like the upper gut shot, basically. Yeah, we're checking queen eight and check eight off. Interesting. Yeah, the suited ones are probably the backdoor uh, draws also. With the young at least. All right, we hit it. We have value. Check, 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 bet 30. Bet no, sometimes he, he has a jack, I think. He cannot bet. Uh, I'm just checking. No. I'm done. This is bet. our best 10. We got to bet. I bet. bet. Yeah, I would bet. We yeah, we got to get our, our thin value with our best 10s. <laughs> yeah. We have, we have to, to get our own. Best he, still has, he still has eight tags, like eight, seven, nine, eight. Every 10 in our range is betting. Every jack is betting. What is he betting turn with the checking? What is his range? He checked two pair on the river. He's checking the. He's betting yeah, L8s. Six. That's a no two pair. Five. I mean. So a lot of six, six, a lot six of is, five. Yeah. But he was betting. He was, oh, he was betting, right? He was betting 30%. Uh, 30 turn he bets uh, 30 in it. He doesn't yeah, bet so. any six or five, or he bets some, but. So he still has a lot of 8x, so we have to bet ten, our 10, yeah. Yeah, a lot of our hands that aren't going to bet the flop are going to contain a jack or a 10. Like a lot of queen jack, we're going to check on that flop. Right, A lot of queen 10, we're going to check. Yeah. We're not checking jack back when we hit it on turn, though, are we? No, but when he bets, we're going to we're going to call we're going to call in position sometimes with that. Right. Oh, he barreled turn. 
No, we did a call. Oh, he bar- I'm saying he barrel turn. I missed. Yeah, he barrel turn. Yeah. Okay. yeah, he he led small. Yeah, so and he does it with eight x. So when we hit our best ten on the river, we can just bet for value. Yeah. And he's probably going to call all his eight x. Yeah, he, he's going to call all his eights, all his sixes. Well, sixes he was checking on the turn. Not all, I think. Not all, but most of them. Yeah, yeah but he's going to call them. Probably ask him then. Because we still have we still have a reasonable amount of bluffs too. Anyway, we're beat. Yeah. Nice check. Yep. No, bad. <laughs> you need to fall into the trap. Yeah, but I think against population, uh, betting is good there. Yeah, I don't think populations check in two pair on the river very often. Uh, less uh, often than the solver does, at least. For sure. And if they race, they don't bluff enough, so. Check. Check I bet. Yeah, we got a back door. He doesn't have jack four, jack yeah. two, two, four. So check. 50% check. Uh, we, I would still bet again. Jack XX. What it was. No, Jack suit. Start getting a side of fold now and just hands with some equity. I we, we would be barreling some spade draws here. For sure. But uh, the Jack's not uh, that good for us, huh? that uh, the Jack came. Yeah. He's going to check raise a lot of his Jacks, I think, on the flop. Yeah, but what else is he continuing with? I mean, well, it's a small bet. They got to continue pretty wide, right? So uh, it's the big blind. Eh? He's overfolding. So most you of show the what, what car, range what? here is the backdoor flush. Like the checking range here is almost all the backdoor flush. So we want to range bet basically here, but not with the backdoor flush. Every every sliver of like checking here is like the backdoor flush, and then like uh, the the backdoor flush and those that miss. Tens, nines, and eights. Even for king eight, the backdoor flush checked more than those that miss. Yeah, she also tens and nines. Uh, the the pairs under the jack. King six, the backdoor flush checks more than the other ones. So it's range bet, but not with the backdoor flush. You show what turn cards are good for us. The check is any different from. I can, but we need to play the turn before. I think when we bet uh, flop too, we, we, we still have the jacks in our range. I, I mean, I'm barreling. I, I don't know if it's good or not, but I'm barreling. I would small check. Big. I would just go small again. No good. So I think a good turn is going to be one of the key cards. So right now, the key cards are Ace, King, Jack, 10, 9. See yeah, I think, I think uh, the other cards are not that good now. But um, Ace, King, Queen. Yeah, so we ten. were supposed to bet large. We were supposed to pot it on that turn? Yes. Okay. When we have a Jack, bro. Because, I mean, we, we, we bet flops, so we have jacks in our range, right? We still have all the over pairs. Yeah, we want to polarize. The, most of the time, we want to size up. But, uh... So it's a pot size on the time. But it's small, but the pot. Bet geometric. So what are our... We're betting jacks? So hey? I think the heuristic here is that the jack is good for the button. It's a key card. And then when a key card pairs, we're betting pot. Yeah, and ace four, king four, queen four. So 
So now, we'll, now hold we'll on. Now go, move. go, check, check, flop, and see if we still bet pot on the turn. I don't think we will. No, of course not. That's a different uh, situation. Yeah. Yeah, so now you just bet small. Okay. You got to bet flop for that. If you see bet, then it's most of the time size it on seven. Right. If you see bet, obviously we're set, we're repping that we got some of those top pairs in our hands. So when it pairs again, it's good for us. Yeah, but also we polarized uh, the big line. Yeah? He's pulling his young. We have draws and uh, good hands. But I'm still not sure about this one. I oh, got him to fall to King Ten. I uh, check. Yeah, when six pairs, that's not good, but six is very bad. King I'm, is still bet, I'm still betting more than 50%, probably. Like 50 it's a double uh, sided board. If the king is good for us, uh, the six is not. Yeah, and it's never 100% check. So. This is like betting a lot. So we bet. Yeah. Well, what? Oh my so goodness, what is this? That was, yeah, you, but, you just showed paired high card. I think yeah. you need a spade. Paired, paired board with the high card. No, the, the six is the, I, yeah, I the six this, is the biggest card in his range. That's the one that he donks the most. That's oh, the most dangerous one. Is, yeah. He I, got I, one key card, he's got I missed, two key cards. I missed that beat, it's a key card for him. Yeah, yeah he's got, got a check trouble that's, we got one. That's why yeah, I wanted to check. Fair for him indeed. Okay, let's see real quick. Do I have this other board? I've still been more, uh, almost forty percent uh, of the time, so it's not that bad. Still love checking me. What Wake was up. our hand again? Ace. Ace eight. Eight. Yeah, yeah no spades. Yeah, there's also a lot of uh, checking from. Okay. And then King eight eight. Mm, betting more. Nine nine. Oh yeah, that's Still good. Be good Still uh, a lot of checking. Okay. All right. So what was the heuristic here? So whenever it was a pair pair board, it's always the, the, the lower the pair, yeah, the more the we get. Pair the pair. Pair. And the six is the one we check the most. Five, six, seven. Five, four, six, four, seven. Five, six, seven. And even the four is kind of eh. There is key cards, right? There's two of those. We only got one key card. That's how I thought of it right away. Like, whether that's really it or not, that's how I saw the hand. Yeah, there's a lot of trips. Huh? The, uh, that's, that's, uh, the, that's the problem. Even our ace king uh, doesn't want to uh, bet 40 big blinds uh, deep. I'm not comfortable putting it all in, I think. Yeah, you're in bad shape when all the chips go in there. When there's a king on the board, two sixes, and they're willing to put all the chips in, they're not doing it with the king, right? Uh, they can do it also with the king. But, uh, <laughs> but uh, they also have a lot of sixes. That's the problem. Hey, that's a good board. You can bet. Woo, better ace fold. We're printing. 
Power of position. Yep. A power it's of no uh, vent to range bet. In the pre-flop ninja, we were getting owned. Even though we yeah. got every answer correct, we, we lost a lot of money. Yeah. Okay, there's an ace. We bet. Yeah, we got draws. So. I got yet. We even he blocks or got yet. So it's, what's... When are we I sizing up? I'm surprised he folds queen nine. <clears throat> it's a red board uh, with h7, so the draw heavy for him. For the big blind. So we yeah, can he's he's, he's but, got better yeah. hands to defend. <clears throat> I'd have been in there bluffing with Queen Nine. Give me if I had a spade for sure, I'd have raised out of the big blind. You have a nine. That's a good one. <laughs> At least you're blocking some of his continuation, right? So nine. Spades even better, probably. Yeah, I'm I'm kind of surprised that his Queen Nine just finds a fold there, but I guess Jack Nine would always continue with the gut shot. Yeah, oh, Jack Nine, I think has to, right? It's an ace-high board, that's why he has to fold a lot. And he has a lot of uh, good draws here. Uh, I guess the queen blocks some bluffs, maybe. I don't know. With us holding a 10 and a 6, kind of natural blockers the 8-7, we could have sized up there, too. Yep. Yeah, that was what we were supposed to do, I think. Yep. Yeah, yeah, sizing up. Definitely. You have good blockers. You have a good shot, even. Yeah, it's our worst draw, and we're holding relevant blockers. And so, yep. And it's an eight-seven board, so there is sizing up on that board. Yeah, it's wet. Yeah, we bet. My cards, go go. <laughs> Sometimes well, that was a good example of why it went betting big and went betting small. Yeah. Six six. Ooh, I don't like it. We have a spade. No. Yeah, it's a six six. So uh, a, <laughs> a check. A check. I'm, I'm check for value. I'm gonna. I'm still checking. Yeah, I think I want to bet still. I want to bet with spades. Oh my goodness! It's a check. Yeah. Oh, checking. Some bet. I wanted to see a turn. Ah, bad for you. You can buy all <laughs> this one. Yeah, we no, we want to check the eight high board paired is bad. It's nine high board and the eight yeah, one. It's, yeah, it's 51, it's 51 percent betting. Uh, we don't have a backdoor uh, draw, so I would check here. The pair card is an eight, so it's not good. It's and queen, good. I would bet maybe. Well, if, uh, just betting. Queen is bad, bad for us. No, it's not bad. bad. It has it's, more. It's not the us. best, but it's not bad. Yeah, not That's if you he didn't go. Uh, you blocked Jack then. With, yeah. I think the queen's Jack. nice yeah. when we. I think the queen's oh, nice man. when we check flat. Oh, we check check. Okay, then it's be maybe bad. Did we uh, did we check Jack then the flop? Yeah, we, we check and we got a gutter. We these are I probe these all the time. So yeah, I'm going for it. A size good. Checking, but you could bet. Yeah, uh, no, I would definitely check. Uh, I only get checking it down and winning. Oh no, the value bet. Value bet or a sign. Are you sure? Crazy. Yeah. Well, we're bluffing. I with see the, betting. The, uh, I don't straight, know. straight block. I, don't, I think it's a bluff with the 10. Yeah, we got a straight block. I think when we bet here, with uh, we get called by worse a sign. No, I think it's a bluff. It checked the. It checked oh, that's a bluff. bluff. We get better ace size fold. No, we, he doesn't have any worse. So do What's we get call? the better hand to fold then? Nope. All nines call. Sometimes he folds a nine. He folds yeah, a nine. That, he folds that's nine. only uh, so small that... Uh, he does fold some nines. So it's, if he's we're only folding those nines, then it's a bluff. Yeah, we're bluffing. He's calling with more nines. And then when we want to size up, sometimes we did. When we size up, we get some better full day put from the nine. Then the then it's then well, still we're trying to get him off a nine on this spot. Yeah, that's how we bluffing. There's a nice we bet. <laughs> Please call. Love it. I really like the overview strategy for the. Or the button. 
it's a really good guide on how to. Yeah, it gives you a good idea of your strategy indeed. Uh, yeah. So I like to see, I, li I like to see the, the, just the three of three of those columns, just monotone, tone, and rainbow. Should we bomb this flop? Can you do that, Josh? No. Oh no, that's I'm no. We that. have monotone here. Yeah, but, but just right but that, that's that's with high card. But I just want to see if there's any difference between monotone, two tone, and rainbow. It's just in general. Yeah, but we have monotone and uh, overview, so then you can uh, subtract the dude. Yeah. <coughs> um, ace. Yes. A bit. He's folding Jack Five. It's got two back doors. Yeah, I'm surprised. I'm over. I'm over defending. That board is is so good for us though. Like King Queen is one of the worst hands we're gonna have that doesn't connect with that board. King Queen connects with 10 9. We're range betting that flop, I think, right? We're gonna have tons of bit worse hands. Yeah, we have to top pair also. Yeah. Betting half pot. How often are we betting that flop? Mm, two high cards? The last flop. Oh, I don't know. Uh, we're we're just gonna the only thing we're gonna do is check the the under pairs for the ten. Don't even know. Range them. I don't think he's. Yeah, I mean that's it's range bet. That's why like I I'm thinking like you're betting everything. I can't fold this, and yet it did. Eights sevens. Okay, so the queen is not good, but uh, we're gonna bet. How bad is the queen here? Not so bad. I yeah, thought that good. might be a queen we put in our check and range. <coughs> it's queen worst, 10, huh? So it's a bit worse uh, queen. Oh, the 10 is good, right? Yeah. So we have a lot of connection with the with queen 10. Yeah. It's still two Broadway cards. Mm -hmm. Yep. Oh. What'd you do with the queen seven of hearts? Are you checking that? No, mm. oh, we're not checking nothing. We're range betting. Well, if you're range betting, I only checking seven percent. That was a different flop. No, it was a uh, queen. The two hearts. It was range betting. Uh, okay. Hey guys, what's up, Paul here? Uh, quick Hi, question. Paul. What's hey, up? Paul. Uh, I I just came to. I'm going to switch my mic on. That's why. Can you tell me if my uh, mic sound is good or or bad? Sound good. Very good. What queen sevens was a okay. check? It would suit. You. You. you didn't look. There were some checks with the queen seven suit. I was just curious what suit it was. Oh, the one we don't have. Oh, not with hearts. Just bets. Just range bet. You just. Oh. Is somebody disappointed that the solver folded? Yeah. Okay. Nothing worse than when you min bet and they you know, they escape. Yeah. Okay, we'll get, in, today. we'll get in next time. I used, to always play, folder. I used to always play trappy with this, like with that in that spot, but I stopped doing it. Bet bet 15. Whew. Oh no. He's raising on this board. Wow. King. What does he have? He has like King Deuce. He has a lot of King uh, offsuits, huh? So, yeah, well, uh, Ace four, get out of here. Yeah, why are you folding? That's a dry board. What was I supposed to call? You knit. Yeah. No. Ninety percent. Oh my goodness! Our oh, wow. <laughs> no. 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 A pair board with an eight. We check. No, we have the upper dangler. We bet. I have the upper dangle in this. I would bet you. Still, we uh, check a decent amount. Yeah. Check high. No spade. It's balanced that we also have the danglers in our uh, checking range. We bet. Uh, I, th 
I think we've got so, we yeah, a bigger the right. It's not bad to bet with, but uh, we don't I mean, have. Be, I think it's going to be fun. I don't think you can make a mistake with this one. Jack and eight are both okay. Mm. Yeah, it's most of the See you on Monday. Uh, happy shop. All over the board. Fair board, high card. That's Matt. Yes. yes. Oops, he's calling. I have the nine of diamonds. Bits. Yeah, I keep, I keep betting with this guy. This I'm is sizing up. A horrible hand. We can never go to showdown. So. You guys want to size up? Yeah, yeah and then give up if he calls. Size up, give up. We need to bet, bet the pot. Bet the pot. Bet the pot. I'll go all in. We have a nine of a diamond. I'm not you know, at least you're, bet. A, you're an absolute maniac here. This is is this our worst hand? No. Yeah. This is uh, I, give give up. Up. I give up now. Yeah, we, we have, have a blocker. Yeah, it's bad. It's not it's a bad marker. Blocker is good. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> You're knit. We would have won. Does he, does he fold that jack six when we bet pot on the turn? Maybe. Because if not, we got to be able to follow through on the river. Or we can't play that that style. <laughs> I, I would like, follow through on the river on the dime. Yep. At least some of the time. Eh? It's not, not that I do it always. But... Starting most of his sixes. So we got to be when we we got to be committed when we uh, on rivers when we do this. Yeah. So what what uh, what, what, what is our jamming rate? We're going for it. All, uh, What's our shutdown with, uh, cards on the river? All cards with a diamond shove. Oh, yeah, but that ace high, I suppose. At least that would I uh, assume. All those crappy hands like 10 high, 9 high, 8 high, probably. Well, I think even the ace hash. He's not calling with... Uh... Crappy hands, I think. This is oh, this is the turn. So what did we do? We to see the range we, that, that we, we bet one hundred and four. Yeah, we bet one hundred four. Yeah. He called. Then we got the four of diamonds, something like that. And then check. And what are we jamming? I would have liked to see. Um, Can you put diamonds on it when we bet pot on term? What the hot the hotness graph for the river. Diamonds. Oh. Six and a nice. <laughs> okay, so that's for him. Check this range. This is what what was that? Yeah. The triangle. That's for us. So we got it pretty much. Oh, we're, going, we're just going for it like half the time. Can yeah. you show it? What What is this leading range on the turn? You have to ace Beautiful. them. You have to pair. <laughs> like this triangle. This is Jack. Jack. Oh, it's only. Sorry. Point zero combos. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. But we're also jamming our A7 of diamonds. Yeah. It's interesting. Sure. sure. Oh, yeah. We got a flush. Uh, I think we should check here. I would bet we got uh, one over. We got the diamonds to the queen up and down. Yeah, we have a uh, blocking okay. queen jack and jack. Uh... Okay. No, it's a check. Oh, I knew yeah. it. We don't have a spade, and the queen is bad. For yeah, it. the queen is bad. You're torching oh, equity. Oh. What do you do here, Ken? It's on you. Fold. You induce me. I am gonna call now. Oh my goodness! Okay, that's good. <laughs> <laughs> now I fold. fold. <laughs> he's supposed to bluff this, but and I know it, but I can't do nothing about it. And he's not bluffing anyway. You know he has a lot of queens, so he bets his five. <laughs> And when and that ace when the ace comes, he cores our worst aces. 
What was the last time that you see uh, a villain uh, uh, check raising his uh, second pair? Yeah, I mean, I mix it in, but I, you're right. No one, I don't see people doing it. Not a lot of need. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't see it. No, we... Of course, I might fall to it as well. But what is no? Why not? not polarizing. Why not? We got a check. Oh, we got a middle pair. We got second pair. We have an ace high board, which is amazing for us. And then we turn a key card. Yeah, yeah. We, we bet pot when we have an ace, or we when we have uh, a draw. Not when we have second pair. I'm think. checking back here. Okay. We need to bet one one o four. Yeah, I was, wasn't betting pot, but I was. Yeah. Okay. But not pot. I felt like that was turning the hand yeah, off. It didn't feel right. Uh, betting pot is better than checking, I think. Yeah. Now we overbet. Although the solver is disagreeing, I mean, yeah. 320 or 160? It's close, pot and... 320. Uh, 320, I'm gonna say. Nope, it's that small. He blocked all his value. He called, so... He called with an eight. What, <laughs> what, does, what, does, what does the big blind do on ace high flops when we see bet and he has an ace? What does he do with his aces? He calls to keep us wide. Uh, he, do, he does some races, of course, but uh, he, shall, he, he probably will hey, do a lot. He's more. raising plenty, plenty of aces. Yeah. Eight kicker. So whenever he has a nine right. kicker or more or better, he raises. Even yeah, a six of course two pair. Well, oh, he doesn't have very many I, nine kickers or better. <laughs> yeah, like yeah, he's so half his aces half the time almost. His ace. So theoretically, yeah. we're trying when we're bowing like this. We are trying to get worse. We're trying to get an ace to fall by the river. So no. what if that wasn't a jack oh. on the river? So we bet see bet flop small. We polarize turn, and let's give us a brick on the river and are we supposed to try to get those weak aces to fold i wouldn't think so but, uh, because his ace are also in there huh? maybe like a six. five of diamonds or something yeah five is uh, connecting with his uh, range yeah i mean it's going to connect with some of it but Oh, nice. Six, five, eight, five. So we're, we're still bombing. It, and it's never folding an ace. Never folding. So I don't... Uh... So I don't understand why we're polarizing the jack on the turn. It's jack eight and jack six. Oh, we key, were not. It, it's a key flop and it's a key turn. Yeah, but it's not polarizing. 104 was the bet, right? Well, that's yeah. large. Uh, well, that's but it's polarizing is more like... Pop. Hey, it's not... Yeah, it's in between. Eh? I mean, what are we? Uh, what is the pot bet range? We can have a lot of flush draws uh, still, can eh? so we uh, want to fold out equity. Uh... So this is the for me. It's pairs and flush yeah, draws. Small. I mean, his spades are not going to fold against a small top pair. Well, top pair plus over. and probably flush draws or straight draws. Yeah, what? straight draws. Straight, more straight draws. So like seven, nine, and nine, yep. ten. He has a lot of four out traders. So gut shots. So like, what are gut shots on this board? <clears throat> seven ten. Seven ten. Seven four. So we only have a few combos of. Well, we don't have seven four. Yeah, man, the big blind has. Yeah, but this is our range, right? Yeah. Yeah, but you know the big blind can have them. And also, yeah, we were we were balancing we were balancing our big bets with uh, gut shots. Yeah, All right. Well, we're going to take seven. our first break. 